Great. Happy Tuesday. Um, so today we're going to talk just about first person point of view. Um, yesterday we talked about one, two, and three. Today we're going to just kind of focus on one, um, do a few activities with one, um, and then we'll move on to second person tomorrow. Okay. So if you remember, what I want you to do is I want you to um, put the definition here for first person point of view. Your first person point of view is when the narrator is the main character in a story. Okay. So the person who is telling the story is inside the story. A character inside the story is telling you what's going on. That's first person point of view. Okay. An example. I woke up and realized I was 20 minutes late. Okay, so um, we know that this is first person point of view because I am a character in the story of my life and I am telling you what's happening. Right? Um, and some words that give it away. I and there's another I there too. Um, but a few other words that we might see are we, our, Maybe a few words that you might see in a first-person point of view. Okay, so um, the activity that you're going to do today, I'm going to do the first one with you, um, and then I'm going to talk you through kind of the rest of it today, okay? So what you're going to be doing is you're going to be changing the story into a first-person story. Okay, so Susie was exhausted for she had stayed up all night. Okay, um, now right now this is in third person because this story is about um, the narrator is talking about the story. They're not part of the story, right? Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to change the story into first person. So instead of Susie was exhausted, I'm going to say I was exhausted for, instead of saying she had stayed up all night, I'm going to say for we had stayed up all night. So, before this was a third-person perspective, um, third-person point of view, I've changed it into a first-person point of view. So, instead of Susie was exhausted for she had stayed up all night, I changed it to I was exhausted for we had stayed up all night. And the reason why I know it's first-person is because I have this pronoun here, I, and this pronoun here, we. That gives it away. <coughs> okay? So, what you are going to do is you are going to, for the next one, do the same thing. And the same thing here, too. Um, on the last slide, what you're going to do is you're going to write a five-sentence or more um, story about playing in the snow. And you're going to be doing it in first person. Okay? So you're going to be using pronouns like I, we, our, those pronouns to um, write this story about playing in the snow. Um, and I want you to do it in first person. Okay? Um, that is it for today. If you have any questions about anything, um, please let me know.